Unvaccinated tennis players have reportedly been told they will be allowed into the country to play at the Australian Open in January. Let's go live to Sunrise supporter Nathan Curry. And Nathan, uh, details are still coming out. They'll still need to quarantine apparently, but what else do we know for now? Uh, well, Eddie, it looks like they'd be allowed into Australia any time after December 1, as long as they do two weeks inside a hotel like they did last summer. While the vaccinated players, they'd be able to come in without quarantining and wouldn't be inside a bubble. This has all come from a supposedly leaked email from the World Tennis Association. It's reached out to its players to clear up any confusion. And in this email, it says it's spoken to Tennis Australia, which has confirmed that unvaccinated players would be allowed into the country, but apparently Tennis Australia asked them not to speak about it for a few days while they worked out details with the federal government. Now, this is a big change from what we've been hearing. Up until now, we thought it was going to be a no-jab, no-play policy. The Immigration Minister has said no one that is unvaccinated would be allowed in. And even yesterday, the Victorian Premier was saying that no freedoms uh, for unvaccinated Victorians, at least well into next year. So it'll be interesting to see what he thinks about this, considering that the Open, of course, is on our turf here in Melbourne. Because if this email is correct, it looks like the unvaccinated will be coming in. And that means we could be seeing no Djokovic defending his crown, whether we agree with it or not, Eddie. Yeah, plenty more to come on this today. Thank you, Nathan.